Hey y'all, today's recipe includes a Middle Eastern eggplant topping or dip, however you wanna call it. We're gonna put that over some shredded chicken. The eggplant topping is basically baba ganoush if you've ever had that. Most likely you will make more of the eggplant topping than you will need for this recipe. I'd eat the rest with some cucumber or carrots for a really easy meal on another day. Let's get cooking. For this dish, we're gonna start with the eggplant. This part of the recipe can actually be made on prep day and kept in the fridge until needed. But you can also make it on the same day as you make the chicken. It is a little bit longer recipe though, so just be aware of that. For the eggplant topping, we're gonna to start by heating the oven to 425. Line a baking sheet with foil, cut slits all over the eggplants, then place them on the foil lined sheet. You're gonna roast the eggplants until the skin is black and charred. That'll take 30 to 40 minutes. When the eggplants are done, take them out of the oven and let them cool enough so that you can handle them. Next, you're gonna take a spoon and take out the insides. Well, first you actually have to cut them in half for that. After you've done that, if you cut them in half and you use that spoon to take out the flesh, be careful not to get any of the skin because the skin can be a little bitter. You're then gonna use a fork to mash the flesh up in a bowl with a little lemon juice, garlic, tahini, and olive oil. You're gonna mash it the whole time so it's well mixed then sprinkle with a little salt to taste. If you make the eggplant topping on prep day, all you have to do for the dish is cook the chicken. But if you make them on the same day, get the eggplant roasting first and then go to the chicken. For the chicken, place the breast in the bottom of a pot and season with salt and pepper. You can be pretty generous. Then cover the chicken breast with one inch of water. Bring the water to a boil, and once boiling, then you reduce it back down so the water is just simmering. Let it simmer for 10 to 15 minutes, depending on the size of the chicken breast. Larger the breast, longer the cooking time. Once the chicken is fully cooked, take it out of the pot and let it cool for 10 minutes. After it's cooled, use two forks to shred it. You'll see me do that technique. When you have your chicken shredded and your eggplant mixture made, place the shredded chicken on a plate and top with some of the eggplant. At this point, you could also add a dash of cayenne or paprika if you'd like. Let's eat.